Hello everyone, I'm Merlin 1977 Welcome back to another episode of Planet Explorers. Let's continue where we left off. <clears throat> so, uh, welcome to Sunrise on Maria. Uh, it's actually 7.30 in the morning. <clears throat> I actually did a ton of stuff off camera. Um, I'll show you what I did. I, uh, <clears throat> I started heading north to the meteor crater and uh, I uh, bought some things from Chen uh, again if you're if you're new to this game um, I did not uh, continue any part of the storyline from the last episode all I did was I visited a few sites uh, to buy some scripts and some items from different people just to make uh, this gameplay a little bit easier so uh, at the meteorite crater where Chen is, uh, he um, he has the arrow script. Uh, so I needed to buy some, uh, uh, well, the, the script for arrows for my bow. Um, I went, I continued going this way. Uh, actually, I found some copper here, and I found uh, like two spots of copper. I found a tiny bit of gold while I was on my way to the rock formation and this was the oil deposit that um, that we knew from Alpha 07. Um, anyway, so I continued on to the rock formation. I bought uh, the headlamp. Uh, if you kind of you can kind of see it, uh, my lamp on the uh, on the side of my head here. I bought that from Lao. Uh, instead of the flashlight because it's always on my head um, what else did I do I went uh, I went I actually didn't visit uh, this is camp I just went I swam straight across went to the crash site <clears throat> coastal crash site I bought a bunch of stuff from uh, Ataro uh, which I did not put on for you guys uh, just yet I, want, I, I was gonna just save it for you guys but um, Basically, I just bought uh, silver armor from him, so I spent, uh, I don't know, uh, 15, 1600 bucks or whatever the heck it was. I also bought an energy shield type 01. I bought a couple of batteries, which we are going to need for the laser weapons, which uh, I will craft uh, shortly. Um, I did not go to the layer back nest. I was just, well, when you're here, this actually pops up as well. Uh, this actually popped. I went uh, north to the Martian camp. Uh, at the Martian camp, uh, there's Na uh, Nan Yang, and I bought from him. Uh, where is it? If I can find it. Um, where did I go? Ah, there we go. This is a resource. That's weird. Uh, anyway, I bought uh, a laser gun grip and a laser muzzle. Um, why did I do that? Well, uh, we're about to kind of... If you're new to Planet Explorers, I'm about to show you the crafting menu. So if you hit J, um, <clears throat> you can essentially get into the crafting menu and build out your own whatever you like, essentially. Um, <clears throat> so essentially the way this works is... Um, in order for the game to know what it is that you're actually building, uh, there are certain components that you must utilize. So the game knows that you're building a sword or um, or a gun or an airplane. So uh, these are some a uh, few of the things that I downloaded. But uh, essentially, these are the only parts that I have. But uh, Anyway, uh, let me show you the ISOs, which are the uh, things that I downloaded from isoplanetexplorer.com. One of the things that I want to craft right now is um, I actually separated this into laser and r regular rifles. But uh, if you, uh, oh, I still have a PE ISO. Yeah, this is huh. PC PE ISO is uh, the old version of that. It's actually VC ISO is the new stuff. But uh, anyway. These are some of the things that other people have created. Um, I would it would take me probably a thousand years, and I still wouldn't get close to to designing anything this close, uh, this good. Um, 
So you can actually see the statistics of all of the things. It takes uh, 115 aluminum, um, 81 pigment. Actually, oh, I also bought a thousand pigment from Nanyang, just so I wouldn't be bothered with it anymore. So this takes uh, one rifle grip and one multi-shot bullet muzzle uh, to craft. So essentially, uh, again, these are the things that you can craft in the game. <clears throat> uh, I did not craft them yet. Uh, but these are some of the things that, uh, if you have these items on the right hand side, you can craft these. Um, so again, if, if you're new to Planet Explorers, um, you can essentially just download these ISO files and put them in your, um, in your documents and settings and uh, Planet Explorer directory and it'll, the game will recognize it. Um, let's see, what else do we have? Uh, some of these uh, don't really have very much attack. The final attack is what's important, uh, 135. So it, it'll, it, it's it, these are like little mini guns, and uh, they don't really do very much damage. I, I don't really bother crafting them. They're just uh, there because uh, they're pretty. <laughs> um, this is something new that I downloaded. I think uh, today, yesterday, something like that. Um, the reason I got it was because it actually does 715 damage and it's got an 80, almost 85% accuracy. So you, you're not really going to miss. Um, so in order, like I said, in order to, uh, to create, say, a gun, okay, you're going to need, you're going to need essentially a minimum of a handgun and a muzzle uh, excuse me a handgun grip and a muzzle so in order to kind of craft these you have to put them uh, actually this is a rifle so you need one of these and uh, one of these so that's how the game knows that you're trying to build a gun um, so in the middle you can actually fill it up with anything you want uh, any any ore, essentially, um, aluminum, gold, diamonds, uh, you can make it out of uh, stone or dirt or whatever. Um, but anyway, so that is basically what the crafting looks like. Um, what I wanted to do was craft, uh, where is it, this laser cannon. Uh, no, I don't want to save that. I, uh, I went and downloaded a bunch of laser weapons. Um, <clears throat> So in order to craft this, I need uh, 27 pigment, which I have a ton of. Uh, this is the reason I bought the grip and the two muzzles from Nan Yang because I need that. And I also need to kind of go dig for aluminum. Uh, <laughs> I forgot about that. Um, so all you really have to do is have the necessary components. You hit that little button right there and you can craft it. Uh, but I forgot about the aluminum. So for now, uh, what I'm going to do is uh, equip myself with some of the items that I bought. Uh, one is, uh, oh, I also bought a gold bow from Nan Yang. So I'm going to replace my crappy gun with that. I also bought uh, a couple of battery packs, one from Atara, one from Nan Yang. I craft, actually I bought the iron pickaxe. Uh, what else do I have? Iron axe, I have <coughs> iron pickaxe, I have, um, and I also, like I said, I bought the silver armor from Ataro on the coastal crash site over here. Uh, so I'm going to equip myself with it so you can kind of see it, what it looks like. Alright, so move that. No, not what I want. I want you to move over there. Alright, so basically all you have to do to equip it is just right click on it. So that's one, I got silver pants, silver boots, silver hat, a helmet, and silver gloves. Should be able to see myself now, yeah, there we go. So this basically adds, uh, you can see the defense on it, uh, it adds a bunch of defense. You can also see that the my helmet is... Um, or rather my, my um, headlamp is actually tailored around the helmet now. 
Uh, this is where the battery goes. Uh, but for now, I'm kind of all set. Um, I, uh, if you can see down here, I uh, built out a bunch of arrows. Uh, let's see. So I also bought a lot of scripts, uh, iron bow script, uh, bow string. I bought this arrow script from uh, Chen uh, because without that your bows are useless. <laughs> uh, I bought bullet script, bought gunpowder script, charcoal, uh, steel bow I believe I got from Ataro, I don't remember. I bought the pigment script. Oh, now it takes water? Ooh. I don't like that. Uh, in Alpha 0 0.7, the pigment script was just these three. It didn't take water. Ooh, wow, okay, so they changed that formula. <clears throat> uh, what else? Copper wire, battery pack. Uh, I bought a bunch of stuff here. Oh, these are just the scripts, by the way. Uh, silver bow, gold bow script, I bought the scripts for the laser components, the laser gun, uh, I bought the script for gold shield, we don't, uh, we don't have any gold yet, uh, I have to go digging for it. I also bought, um, a bunch of food scripts from the Martian colony, from, uh, up here. I uh, forgot who I bought them from, but uh, she had a whole bunch of them. Uh, oh, you're kidding. That's a thing now? Okay, hold on. Well, I'll get to that in a second. I just wanted to kind of go through this. Uh, so now they have this organic fertilizer uh, as opposed to the regular fertilizer spray. So that's kind of new. And uh, before, I <laughs> before I click on the last one, uh, I found the... Um, the animal feces guys so <laughs> you can actually pick it up which uh, apparently is a thing now so where's that feces just to show you all right here it is animal feces basically uh, I haven't seen any animals drop it it's just um, again if you're kind of uh, watching this eating food uh, just cover your ears <laughs> um, Essentially, it's just lying on the ground, there's steam coming out of it, and there are a whole bunch of flies circling it. So if you kind of run around, uh, you, you'll end up seeing it eventually. Um, but yeah, so evidently you build stuff with it, uh, which is this, which I don't even know what this is used for. Uh, so, I, so it takes one animal feces, water, and charcoal. And what the hell do you do with it? Organic, oh, this is for organic fertilizer. Uh, where's organic fertilizer? Let me see where that is. Uh, I think I bought that script from her, if I'm not mistaken. Ah, so, so in order to build out the organic fertilizer pellet for the gun, you need to have manure. And manure takes animal feces. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, yeah, so um, another thing that I discovered, which is very odd, I'm not sure if it's a bug or not. Um, sleeping, uh, it kind of, uh, it's kind of screwed up in this game, actually. <clears throat> So basically, the wood bed, um, it's supposed to increase your stamina. It's supposed to increase your stamina. So if you kind of look at my stamina, I have 380 right now, and it, it'll drop down one, uh, you know, every minute or something. But now, if I sleep, um, instead of increasing my, uh, my stamina, it decreases it. So here, let me sleep for an hour. I ha remember, I have 380. So let me sleep for an hour and watch what happens to my stamina. Come on, let's go. Get up. Alright, so... See that? It dropped it like 20 points. Rather than increasing it 5, it dropped it. So I'm thinking that's a bug in the game. 
Uh, I have not slept at all uh, since the last gameplay that you saw me. Uh, basically what I had to do was uh, just uh, buy a whole bunch of nuts and a whole bunch of compressed biscuits. I have uh, all these food rations uh, because of, I think they implemented um, hunger in this game because now I have some kind of balanced diet. I, either I didn't see it before um, or this is something new in this game but there's basically hunger in this game. Uh, so anyway, just wanted to kind of point that out to you. All right, so let's continue the story. I'm uh, I have all my my uh, outfit now, and uh, I'll craft out the the laser gun after this mission. Yes. I, I have to go and and dig for some aluminum, but uh, for now, let's uh, let's continue let's continue the story. Uh, I'm still not feeling too well. Unless there's a doctor around, I don't know uh, how long I'll last. All right, so stay here, look around. I'll look around, and I'll find some uh, someone I to help you. I saw a boat land a bit north of here. Someone has to be there. Before you go, let me give you these uh, sword and shield scripts. Be, uh, be careful out there. All right, so she's giving me wood sword and wood shield scripts, which are kind of <laughs> worthless. I have absolutely no interest in building out uh, swords in this game. I'm I'm the kind of person that likes uh, ranged attacks, and the first chance that I got, I built out uh, bows and arrows. So that's my preferred choice up until I hit the laser um, weapons or even the guns, but. Um, But for now, I'm uh, I'm actually good. I'm I'm doing. Uh, I have the gold bow, which does a, a very good amount of damage. Actually, uh, it does 98 attack, as opposed to my crappy knife, which does 14 attack. So we'll continue. Uh, we'll head on over to Carter's camp. And in the meantime, I will be looking for the steaming pile of feces, which I've, I've already found like three or four of them. And I saw that you can pick them up, but uh, I did not realize they were necessary components to, <laughs> to something in the game, which, uh, which is hilarious. Um, so again, you, you can kind of you can kind of see the feces. Um, like I said, it's steaming and you can't miss it. Alright, so anyway, these uh, these green plants are the Maria Sunflowers. And these are the ones that I will be picking up um, to craft out the, the um, revival shot. <clears throat> another, uh, again, another reason why I, I went so far out here is because whenever we are in the story where it requires us to go here I don't have to retrace my step I don't have to go on foot here I can just uh, fast travel to those places you can only fast travel once you've been to a location so now I can just fast travel to those places and uh, not have you guys uh, sit around waiting for me to go through um, boy it's good to see you alive what in the five hells happened I heard a loud bang and down we went. Luckily for me, I was seated right next to a lifeboat. <laughs> what do you want? Alright, who are you? What the? Did the shock regress your mind? Next time you forget your favorite doctor's name, I'm gonna smack you on the head. It's me, Alan Carter. What do you want? How many of you came down on this boat? Jen and Sly came down here with me. They're out looking for all the survivors, though. She'll be back here shortly. What do you want? All right, so let's continue the storyline mission with Gertie. What? Little hook. Damn. Hold on, let me get my things and then we can go. Guard me against the animals on the way, though. I'm only a doctor. Done, let's go. 
Alright, so we're gonna head back. Um, let's see. Anything? Ah, yes. I need, a, I need one of these. So, I'm gonna end up having to pick up a whole bunch of these um, these purees because since I can't sleep now I mean I could sleep but it doesn't do what it's supposed to do which is give me stamina uh, I'm gonna have to just gather up as many of these as possible um, there's nothing I could do guys I'm guessing there's gonna be a buck fixed version to 0.8 but uh, until then, we're going to have to just live with it. Alright, so let's head back. Still keeping a lookout for that damn feces. I'm really hoping you guys can see it because it's, it's just hilarious. Um, Alright, well, since this guy is going to... Actually, we get two for one special once he kills once he kills that guy. Come on. There you go. So, like I said, this is my preferred uh, preferred attack method. Uh, so, we, like I said, we get two for one special. Thanks for killing him, saving me a couple of arrows. So essentially you have to protect Alan Carter from all of those uh, animals. The only ones that really are around here that can attack uh, Carter are those hares, which I just killed one. So that's why I'm killing those guys because eventually they'll, they'll just attack uh, Carter. So we're just going to head back to Gertie, get... Uh, get Carter to drag her back to Carter camp and uh, continue the storyline from there. <clears throat> have to keep a lookout. This guy, uh, see how slow he is now? It takes him forever to, to come with me. Watch what happens when, when he picks up Gertie. He's actually, it's, I don't know, it's the funniest thing in the world. He, he somehow <laughs> picks up speed and he outruns me. He's taking his sweet time, you know, walking regularly, and now... Gertie, you sure look like crap. Thanks. It's good to see you, too. Hold still, and I'll give you something to stabilize you. We'll need to move you to the other camp, though, since most of my supplies are there. Plus, it looks dangerous here. Do you think you can move? I think so. Give me a hand. You're gonna be on guard duty again. Lead us back to the other camp. Your wish is my command, but what's in it for me? Other than saving a beautiful old man and a young lady in distress, how about three med packs? Fine. All right, now watch him. Watch him run. He's out running me. I mean, really? How's he faster with another 150 pounds on his back? <laughs> it's hilarious. He was an old man up until he, he found Gertie. Now he's, uh, he's like a 20 year old. Anyway, one of the funny things in this game. Alright, so I'm going to have to go ahead of him. So, uh, the stamina really just drops down significantly, and if they really... <clears throat> I know they implemented um, eating for the NPCs at your colony, but um, I was not aware that they implemented you know, some kind of hunger system, which technically... Technically, uh, that's what this is, so... I'll have to keep a lookout for it, but I'm guessing that's what this is. Where'd he go? Stay with me, man. It's 
So we're gonna do a whole bunch of uh, med medical type missions now with uh, Carter to get uh, med packs and get uh, revival shot formulas and things like that scripts. Is that his back? That was funny, right? His back was hurting. Yeah. All right, here we go. Have you seen any other survivors around here? I saw several other lifeboats on radar when we were gliding down. They're mostly to the west of here. Other than you folks, we haven't seen anyone else in person. Hmm. Where are my med packs? I've added as promised. What do you want? Uh, these are missions, I guess. Uh, but let's go. What's with all the uh, dangerous animals around here? Do I look like a zoologist to you? If we only had that uh, copper field go around. But still, I am kind of worried uh, that we may not find <clears throat> or might not see even see the next sunset. With that in mind, I've been working on a chemical boost that will get us uh, out of immediate danger. If we're having a close shave. But I need some materials to make it happen. Think you could help me out? Sure. Go and find these materials and I'll uh, tell you how to make a revival shot. I think I already have all that. Uh, simple plastic I have to craft. Yeah, I already bought that. Med pack. Kind of worthless for me. Uh, I already bought simple plastic script, so let's craft. The one thing I don't like about this system is that it's not in alphabetical order. You have arrows down here. You have uh, wood up here. Um, so I'm not really, I'm not too fond of this, uh, unless there's a way to, to sort it, which I don't think there is. Uh, it's not in alphabetical order, it's kind of annoying. So now I have to search for simple plastic. Uh, wood shield, wood sword. Alright, where the hell is simple plastic? There we go. Alright, so how many do I need? I need one simple plastic, so I'll just make one. So, yeah, that's what. this is why I've been collecting the Maria Sunflowers, the Psychus, and the Shadeweed. Uh, because that's what it takes to make the revival shot. Psychus was that uh, spiky plant that I showed you in episode one. Um, the Maria Sunflower are these yellowish green plants and then the shade weed are those purple tipped uh, plants so anyway uh, I already have all that stuff let's turn let's turn that quest in the other scripts the revival shot needs uh, still with the way you're running around this place you probably won't see the next sunrise even with the shot uh, how much you want to bet now that I've created the revival shot script I want to make sure it actually works you know application of theory and all Want to try it out? It's simple. Just go beat up <laughs> some wild beast and uh, use it when you're down. What? No way. Come on, do it in the name of science. Alright, so basically, I'm not too fond of this mission now because what, what they implemented in this game, or in Alpha 08, is when you die, you randomly lose uh, something. Uh, did I already? Uh, wow, well, I guess I already did. Hold on, let me sell them back all this garbage. I already, ha I already have that stuff. Uh, this I have, this I have. So let me sell it back to him. Four bucks there, four bucks here. Uh, let's see, what does he have? I have most of it. Uh, biscuit one. Oh, I don't have this? That's biscuit one. Alright, I'll buy this from him. Portable med pack. I'll buy that script for him. That's not really all that important. Herbal juice I have. Um, so essentially when you start out, you can come here and buy the crappy looking stuff. Um, oh, I had no interest in that. I need. I wanted some good armor, so I just went and got the silver armor. But uh, what does he have? Wood bow script. Yeah, so when you start the game, when you come here, you'll actually start out with a wood bow. Uh, but I didn't I didn't care for that. You can... Uh, I already bought the headlamp. 
pick uh, you can get the crappy pickaxes too which I had no interest in and that stuff alright so like I said you actually end up losing one or a few of your items that you have in your inventory if you die um, which I'm not too fond of but there's not you know I have to do this mission so let's go uh, actually before I do Let me, since I'm going to die anyway, I'm going to take, uh, is there a way I can, alright, I'm going to take all this, uh, armor off, because, oh, oh wow, I had no idea she was in there, okay, that's new, that's something I didn't do in, uh, in, in the other alpha version, uh, Okay, interesting. Did not realize they go down to their skivvies. Uh, I took it all off because um, if I allow one of the animals to beat me up, they it, my um, my armor just loses durability. So uh, since I'm ha since I have to die anyway, I uh, I might as well might as well do it while I'm naked or semi naked. Alright, where the hell is... I need to find one of those hairs because um, they're easy to kill with my bow and... And I can kind of use my revival shot and then end up killing them. Alright, where are those hairs? You know, I've been trying to avoid them while I was here, and now I'm trying to find one, and I can't find one. Seriously. Uh, actually, you know what? I can attack this guy, and he's going to just end up killing me. So, I might as well just attack him. Alright. Ah, shoot. No, I don't want to do... I, I don't want to do it when they're in a pack, because then they'll just end up kicking my ass. Alright, let me go to this guy down here. Alright. So I basically, you just have to let him kill you, that's it. Come on. Can you kill me already, please? One more shot. One more. Alright, there we go. So, that is the end of that mission. Alright, let me kill this. Uh... Alright, so that finishes out the mission. Uh, where's the silver stuff? Alright, now I'm back to that. Uh, let me check to see what I lost. Um, I'm not sure exactly how it works, but you're supposed to, uh, to lose something randomly. I'm not sure if it's... it might be a resource. I have no idea. I guess we'll find out, but, um... I, I have absolutely no idea how that new system works, so... We'll see what happens. I actually thought about just leaving that stuff in, uh... In storage. And when I'm out and about, just, um... Just have not very much with me, essentially. Anyway, that's the revival shot, so basically, as you can see, uh, that's why I built out so many of them. Um, especially as you move on later th uh, through the game, it, um, it really helps out a lot. So you're going to end up dying a lot. Well, maybe not so much now, because I have all this uh, brand spanking shiny new armor with me. But uh, when I did my last gameplay, <laughs> uh, I got my butt kicked royally plenty of times. Alright, here's what your do you want? Yeah, yeah, finish what you told me to do. 
Works better than I thought, seeing how you're still up and about. Uh, I guess I really am a glorious genius, haha. Huh? Alright, let's continue. Huh? Where are the others? I'm not sure. I think Chen went west to a crater, while Sly went north towards some big tree. You might want to check on them since it looks like you have nothing better to do. If you go bring them both back, I'll teach you how to make a med pack. Done. Alright. I've highlighted the two locations on your map. Don't die out there and hurry back. Alright, so essentially Chen is here, which uh, see now I don't have to walk all the way. I can just fast travel there and then this is the big tree which I will have to go uh, up to get it. But uh, we'll probably do that in the next episode. I also need to, if I remember correctly, there was some aluminum around here. Uh, at least that's what uh, that's where it was in Alpha 0.7. So I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna check out if there's still that pile of aluminum there. Uh, I also need to eat some stuff because uh, my stamina is really low. And as you can see, they added a whole bunch of this stuff. Uh, again, if maybe I have not seen this before, uh, but I think this is new. So. I do have to kind of keep eating nuts and com uh, I kind of want to make a whole bunch of these compressed biscuit threes because they uh, they gave me 425 stamina in one shot so until then until until I uh, get a, a fresh supply of you know of all these things when I start planting my own uh, farm um, I'll just have to live with this stuff. Alright guys, so I'm going to cut it out here. I'm going to continue the Chen mission, or to find Chen in the next episode. I'm going to try and find some aluminum in the other direction. Gertie is actually in a medical bay type thing, uh, so she's getting well. So we'll continue this. We'll continue this uh, in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye for now.